When we write a number as the sum of the place values of its digits, it is called the expanded form. Let us write the number four seven two one eight six in the expanded form. We first find the place value of each digit. Thus, the expanded form of four lakh seventy two thousand one hundred eighty six is four lakh plus seventy thousand. Plus two thousand, plus one hundred, plus eighty, plus six. Do you remember how to compare small numbers? To compare the large numbers, we follow the same rules. Let us see what the rules are. A number having more number of digits is greater than the other. Three two five eight has four digits, and nine five six has three digits. So, three two five eight is greater. Four seven eight six one is greater than eight three zero one because it has five digits, and eight three zero one has only four digits. Seven five one. Zero zero six has six digits, while seven five one zero six has five digits. So seven five one zero zero six is greater. When the numbers have equal number of digits, in this case, we start comparing the leftmost digits. If they are equal. We start comparing the next digits. We continue till we come across unequal digits at the corresponding places. Now let us compare seven lakh forty-five thousand one hundred ninety-three and seven lakh forty-five thousand one hundred fifty-eight. We see that seven is equal to seven. The leftmost digits. Four is equal to four, which are the second digits from the left. Five is equal to five; they are the third digits from the left. One is equal to one, fourth digit from the left. Nine is greater than five, the fifth digit from the left. So. Seven four five one nine three is greater than seven four five one five eight. Do you know what do we get when we add or subtract one from a number? Yes, one more than a number is called its successor, and one. Less than a number is called its predecessor. For example, the successor of two thousand eight hundred and forty-nine is two thousand eight hundred and fifty, and the predecessor of ten thousand is nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. Now let us discuss how to build the greatest and the smallest number. Using some given digits, to build the greatest number, we arrange the digits in the descending order. To build the smallest number, we arrange the digits in the ascending order. Let us form the greatest and the smallest five-digit number using the digits seven, four, one, five, and two. Arranging the digits in descending order, we get the greatest five-digit number as seven five four two one, or seventy-five thousand four hundred twenty-one. Arranging the digits in ascending order, we get the smallest five-digit number as one two.
12,457 or 12,457. Now, use the digits 80479 to build the greatest as well as the smallest five-digit numbers. Clearly, the greatest number is 98,000. 740. If we arrange the digits in ascending order, we get the number as 04789. It is actually 4789, a four-digit number. So whenever one of the given digits is zero, it is not written at the extreme left. While working the smallest number. We write zero in the second place from the left. So the smallest number is four zero seven eight nine. In the previous class, we have read how to round off numbers to the nearest tens. Let us see how we round off or estimate number to the nearest ten, hundreds, or thousands. For rounding a number to the nearest ten, we look at the ones digit. If it is less than five, replace the ones digit by zero, and retain the other digits. If the ones digit is five or more than five, then increase the tens digit by one, and replace the ones digit by zero. Consider the number. Two five eight three. Here, the ones digit is three, so we replace the ones digit by zero. In one zero two five eight, the ones digit is eight, so we increase the tens digit five by one, and replace the ones digit by zero. For rounding a number to the nearest hundred, look at the tens digit. If it is less than five, replace the ones and tens digit by zero, and return the other digits. If the tens digit is five or more than five, then increase the hundreds digit by one, and replace the tens and ones digits by zero. Let us now round off. Four seven one two six to the nearest hundred. Here the tens digit is two, so we replace the tens and ones digit by zero. To round off two zero seven three to the nearest hundred, we look at seven, which is greater than five. So we increase zero by one. And replace the tens and ones digits by zero. For rounding a number to the nearest one thousand, we look at the hundreds digit. If it is less than five, then replace the ones, tens, and hundreds digits by zero, and retain all other digits. If the hundreds digit is five or more than five. Then increase the thousands digits by one, and replace the hundreds, tens, and ones digits by zero. For example, consider the number five zero six one seven four. Here the hundreds digit is one, so replace the hundreds, tens, and ones digits by zero. In seven four five zero three, the hundreds digit is five, so we increase the thousands digit four by one, and replace the hundreds, tens, and ones digit by.